Turha sitä on ikkunasta kyttäillä. Tilaa taksi kätevästi Puukko sovelluksella ja tiedät milloin taksi on pihassa. Welcome to Let's Go Taxi Mikkelis interview Charlie Saro and Teemu Henritius. <laughs> We are going to uh, Ikeoma Arena now and we're gonna have their little uh, Finland against Canada table ice hockey game. So get ready for it. <laughs> Easy win for me. Yeah, probably. <laughs> yeah, but uh, before that let's talk a little bit about you guys. Uh, where have you born? Uh, I'm from Helsinki. I lived there almost entire my life. Uh, I, I lived one year in Vasa, and and basically after I think it's my fourth or fifth year here. Mm. So yeah. Okay. What kind of uh, city Helsinki was when you were young? Uh, obviously, it's my hometown. I, I love it. There yeah. is Mikkeli is a little bit smaller city. Uh, there is. All my friends are in Helsinki, so so it's kind of special place for me. And I think there is much much more things you can do yeah. outside the hockey than in here. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah. How about Charlie? Where you have born? Um, I was born in Ottawa, Canada. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I but I've I've been or moved around a lot, so. I don't think I'm. I don't. I'll go. I won't go through the whole list, but okay. uh, I've been in Europe for four years now, and okay. um, I've been to Germany, Austria, Slovakia, Denmark, mm -hmm. and now in Finland in Mikkeli. Yeah. And uh, the city is small, but it's nice and yeah. it's easy to get around and stuff. So, Charlie, uh, tell me a little bit about Ottawa. What kind of city? Um, it is. It's, it's a lot like uh, actually. When I was in Helsinki, I, I actually felt a lot like it was like a, like in Ottawa. It's uh, okay. about you know we're about eight hundred thousand to one million population, mm -hmm. so it's a pretty big city. We have a really nice downtown, and mm -hmm. there's just a lot of stuff to do. And it's I don't know, it's 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 like a lot bigger city feeling than McKelly, obviously. But uh, mm -hmm. yeah, that's that's where I'm from, so I'm a little biased. I'm obviously I really love that city, and uh, it's it's home for me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, how old you were when? Um, I left. I left home when I was 14. Uh, I moved to Toronto okay. to go play hockey, and uh, not an easy time for <coughs> uh, a mom to let go of a 14-year-old kid. But yeah, yeah, I had. I, she knew that I wanted to play hockey, and I moved five hours away from Ottawa, and then uh, never looked back ever since. <laughs> yeah, always been gone. <laughs> and then you were in Germany. And no, uh, and then I played junior hockey in uh, in Sarnia and in Kingston, and then. Uh, And then I played pro. I signed my first NHL contract with Anaheim, and I was playing in the American League in uh, Norfolk, Virginia Beach. And then I, yeah, and then I left to Austria and Germany after three years there. Okay. Yeah. What kind of childhood you had? Oh, I did was. Do you have siblings, or do you have siblings? Yeah, I have an older sister. Um, she's a uh, she's a singer, so okay. she's been uh, doing very well for herself in the music industry. And then uh, my childhood, I mean, was the typical kind of hockey player childhood. Uh, had a lot of friends, and we would uh, meet up to play street hockey, and to during the winter we'd go on the outdoor rink and play together. It was very revolved around playing hockey and just being with your friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How about table? Uh, for me, I did a lot of sports when I was young. Uh, at one time. I did four sports at the same time, so that almost took all of my time mm. after school. So yeah, and I have other sister too. Uh, she's a dancer, and I dance a little bit too oh, when really? I was I was younger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What kind of dance? <laughs> uh, it was uh, in my school. There was like a I say like there's like like. You can go to music class, dance mm -hmm. class, or tech class. I went uh -huh. to the okay. dance class. So yeah. uh, we were young, so we did all kind of dancing. street and the hip hop. Yeah, and, and yeah. ballet and stuff yeah. like that. Okay. Um, how you end up playing hockey? You know, like first place. 
Uh, for me, my father played hockey, so it's uh, he kind of put me on skates when I was young, and I I loved it, and mm -hmm. and I've been playing hockey mm -hmm. after that. So yeah, it was kind of like my my father played hockey. Actually, my grandfather also played hockey oh, really? way back, way back when hockey was a little bit different yeah. than now. <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of hockey's been always really close in our family. So yeah. yeah. How about Charlie? How you end up playing hockey um, in the first place with your friends or? Yeah, no, it was very similar to Temo. Um, my dad played hockey, and he was very passionate about the sport. So. Um, he kind of got me on skates at a young age, and, and I, I fell in love with the game. And he, he watched a lot of hockey. Um, I could he was a big Montreal Canadian fan, and every every Tuesday was like the night where I would get to stay up a little later and get to watch the full hockey game with him. So hockey was always like such a positive thing because I would just get to yeah. spend time with my dad and stay up a little later when my mom was out of the house and okay, <laughs> just nice. yeah. So he, yeah, I fell in love with the sport really young. Yeah. yeah. Uh, who was your biggest idol when you were younger? Well, obviously, ice hockey player. Yeah, ice hockey players, obviously. Uh, of course, Jari Kurri, mm -hmm. uh, Teemu Selanne. But, like, I remember when I was uh, young, Ville Peltonen. Mm -hmm. He played the same number as I played, 16. Yeah, so, true. so, and obviously, he was a really good player, and mm -hmm. I look up to him. and. He was like my biggest fan who played, yeah. played in Finland. Yeah. How about Charlie? Well, for me, I mean, uh, like as a, a pro hockey player, I think I was a big fan of like Joe Sakic and Steve Eiserman and those guys. They were uh, Canadian-born guys and mm. I really looked up to them. Uh, they were really talented hockey players, but um, I would say like even more of an idol would have been my dad just because he like showed me everything and just mm. the one that brought me into yeah. the game so I kind of feel like I own to say that he's my idol for that part yeah so let's continue inside the arena yeah now here never yes that's a one face off but <laughs> oh rim it <laughs> Is still living in Canada? Yeah, my yeah, both uh, both my parents live close to Ottawa and my sister as well. So, yeah. um, unfortunately, it's kind of part of the business. I don't see them as much as I would like to. Mm -hmm. Oh, ah, <laughs> so it's your turn. You can continue. Yeah, um, yeah, but they're all still living there, and I think uh, one day when I hockey is done for me, I think that's where I'll be settling down as well. Yeah. yeah. So first question. Who has been the best player or the coach who you have met in your career and why? Best player or best coach? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna who have met. Who have met. Um, I'm gonna go with Ready. best player. And I'm gonna say I know. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go with Timo Solani. Yeah, I do. So he was uh, oh I would so Yeah, I'd say Timo Timo Solani was pretty special. Oh, <laughs> to, to play, I played with him in an exhibition game uh, in Anaheim, and uh, he was on the ice with me in practice and stuff. And I was just so, uh, you know, shocked because, in, and like in awe because he's such a legend in the NHL. And, yeah. and it actually ended up being one of his favorite players, which is funny because now I get to say I you know, was playing with him and stuff. So, <laughs> but yeah, he, he's probably the best and uh, the most uh, special player I've been around. Yeah. What kind of person Tim was? He was actually he was really easy, like going, very nice and very like funny. So, I mean, I didn't get to speak to him that much, but I could yeah. see him around all the other players, and he was just you could tell he would just like love hockey and love being at the rink with the guys, and it was just you know a happy guy, which mm -hmm. was nice. We were talking <laughs> about the time when you were uh, younger, but uh, what kind of students you were in school? Uh, I was pretty decent, or like I wasn't bad at school, but I need to work mm -hmm. for getting good, good grades. So it wasn't like that. I just go to the test and do well. So, but yeah, 
school has been always important for me mm -hmm. and and actually I'm right now in uh, Haga Helia uh, it's like uh, I don't know what it's called in English uh, Pela Yhdistyksen Suomen Pela Yhdistyksen tai Liikan Pela Yhdistyksen kautta tota, järjestää sellaisen niin kuin pelailee mahdollisuuden mm. käydä kouluun jääkiekoehdon ja, okay. ja aikataulun mukaan. Joo, joo. So... This guy is broken, doesn't spin. Yeah, blame it on that, buddy. <laughs> How about Charlie? What kind of student you were? Um, I was actually a pretty good student in school as well. Um, I, I didn't like school, but I was, I was, good. I was pretty good at it. I, uh, I had some good parents help me through my school years too, so like, <laughs> I guess they, they helped a lot and yeah. taught me a lot at the same time, even if I wasn't in school. So school was pretty easy until uh, about grade, I think grade eight. Oh, this guy doesn't want to... Take your time. This I'm guy, ready. Look, doesn't want to, oh, there we go. What? <laughs> he doesn't want to twist. <laughs> I know I have the same problem with yeah. my left winger. Yeah, but I can't shoot it though. I can only go backhand. <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible. I Give it to me. Give it to me. It's hard sometimes. Yeah. Oh, no, I lost my chance. Um, yeah, so uh, in, right about uh, grade eight, I, I moved to an all English school. My first language is French. And uh, my parents obviously are French. I speak French to them. So I didn't know that much English, which is. Uh, shocking to a lot of people because they just think that Canada, you know, everyone speaks English perfectly and yeah. that, yeah. But my first language was French and I, I was, didn't know, like I said, that much English. Okay. So, um, <gasps> so okay. uh, yeah, when I moved to an all English school, I kind of had to learn the language as I was learning the material. Yeah. So it was a little tougher then, but yeah. I still manage and now I think my English is pretty good. Yeah. 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 It's good. You sound really? like proper like, Yeah, I could be an English for, yeah. yeah. What are you afraid of and why? Oh, afraid of? Um, I can go really deep here or just something like very normal. I'm like phobia, like snakes. <laughs> I'm scared of snakes. Snakes, you too. I'm terrified of snakes. What is this snakes? <laughs> I hate snakes. Because last time when we were talking with Rayo, uh, he also said that he's scared of yeah, snakes. snakes. Very scared of snakes. Um, but on a more deep level, having regrets like regretting things would be my worst like you know living my life and being like ah like i should maybe i should have done this or maybe i should have done that differently so when i do things i try to do it all out that way there's no regrets <laughs> yeah 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 oh, oh. I, <laughs> I was trying nice to one right nice up. try <laughs> you are going to score right away <laughs> <laughs> Tehdään tähän väliin koppikierros. Not the most 
<laughs> so how your no nose is now? It's a lot better now. A lot better, yeah. okay. The doctor did a really good job with the stitches. So okay. Um, this is the trainer's room. That's where they do their magic, but it's, they lock it because it's their special room and they don't want anyone in there, so that's okay. Okay. Yeah. Show me your places. Place. Can you choose no, your place? No, it's usually, I don't know, if the coaches or... Yeah, it's kind of give it to you. Yeah, it's give it to you. Yeah. 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 All right. This is my place. I'm going to pick Kuno. You always say, because I think he's the best player in the world. So, it's my one of my idols. He signed it for me and put a heart. So, I'm pretty lucky. And then, uh, yeah, you know, I want to have my first top goal is when you get it, hopefully some more soon against the Pelicans. That was at the start of the year. And other than that, pretty normal dressing style. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then we can show you the lounge area. Okay, so this is your lounge. This is, yeah, this is where we come to watch TV in the morning. Or, yeah, we can watch overplay. We want to fill in here. Coaches will give us <laughs> stuff we need and yeah, we can learn from there and speak with my mates what to do. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Oh, wow. Do it. Do it. Buddy. <laughs> Take it. No. no. <laughs> Uh, what kind of plans you have in the long distance? Let's start with child first. For me? Yeah, what are you going to do after hockey career? Uh, after hockey? I've, you know what, I get this question a lot and uh, up to now, me too. It's, <laughs> it's hard to know exactly. I would obviously like to stay in the sport and mm -hmm. be a coach or, you know, maybe... <gasps> oh my god. So close! Where's my goalie? This guy. Oh uh, no! <laughs> 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 yeah. uh, maybe be a player agent or, you know, uh, work uh, like as a trainer for athletes mm -hmm. in like kind of like what my trainer is to me in the summer and stuff. Yeah. Um, but if I were to be away from hockey, um, I think, I honestly think I, I'm a very big, I'm very passionate about animals minus snakes. <laughs> so as a kid, I know I always wanted to be like uh, either a vet or like an assistant vet or something oh, like that. Yeah, I'm a, I have a pretty, pretty big passion about animals in general. So I think that would be super interesting if, let's say, I hadn't found a passion for hockey. I think I probably would have pursued that. So, yeah. Uh, have you had any pets? Yes, I've had a lot of dogs my whole life. Oh, I've nice. uh, I've worked on farms and just been around a lot of animals and just okay. always like read books about animals and just, you know, my Instagram account is all about animals and stuff oh. like that, yeah, so. <laughs> That's penalty. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pretty white. <laughs> you can <see> your hand. <laughs> Here, you can drop it again. Where we start. From the middle. Here. Oh. oh. What? Oh, easy. <laughs> 
Ah! 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 First go! Yeah. Yay! And you can take okay. a question. Ooh, I hope it's a hard one. Last one. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> what emoji you use the most in WhatsApp and why? <laughs> uh, I think the, the laughing face with the, the tears. Crying, yeah, okay. I think it's that <laughs> because I only talk with Charlie and it's so <laughs> stupid and funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one actually. <laughs> okay, I like that. Are you that. using the same? I, I definitely use that one a lot. I have a lot of top emojis though. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> some I can't talk about in on camera, but um, yeah, that, I think the laughing face is really funny. Yeah. That's a good one. But maybe the heart, the heart is. Yeah, heart is. You know, that's... you show some love. I send it to the boys. Oh, come on, <laughs> the boys or to my girlfriend. Either one, you know, they they get a lot of love from me. Yeah, <laughs> and then scores right away, so you can yeah. take one. In the team, whose dress, dressing style needs the most updating? Why? Who needs the most? Updated. <laughs> Vadim. <laughs> you don't you're... like Jordan? <laughs> yeah. I like, I, I mean, he's, he's uh, he always wears like uh, Jordan stuff and like basketball stuff, but he's, he doesn't player. play basketball at all. So <laughs> I just think it's think funny because, yeah, yeah, just doesn't fit. But I think it's like a Russian thing because Yako kind of gets that yeah, same style sad. going. Yeah. So maybe it's a Russian thing, so I can't oh, really okay. judge. Yeah. Maybe we have to ask one. Yeah, 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 ask him why he wears so much Jordan, Air Jordan <laughs> stuff. <laughs> All right, so, in the middle. Hey. Are you ready? What? What's going on? <laughs> That's part of the game, that but he wears it. penalty. <laughs> yeah. Oh. That's your only chance. Okay, oh. so. First. <sighs> and it's 4 1. Yeah. Chip them. All right, shoot me that question, buds. Yeah. Who is the person you called last? What did you talk about? Oh, um, actually, it would have been my mom. Yesterday was her birthday. Oh, so yeah. I called her on FaceTime to wish her a happy birthday and uh, just tell her that my nose is OK and <laughs> life is still pretty d dark and cold in Finland. Okay. But let's say together to Charlie's mom, happy birthday. OK. Yeah. There. Yeah. Happy birthday, Charlie's yeah. mom. <laughs> yeah, she'll like that. She, she, she follows the account, so she, she definitely will watch it. So that's good. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. This ref is a little... Okay, how about uh, your free time? What you like to do in your free time? Taking naps. <laughs> <laughs> I know Charlie loves that. Uh, I do like my naps. <laughs> um, no, I, I try to, like, obviously, if I can... Uh, make some calls back home and stay in touch with my family and mm. my girlfriend and friends. That's uh, pretty big for me. Oh, but I, I know he's missed so many today. He's like <laughs> me right now. Um, oh, he's oh, every time. Well. <laughs> um, but I also watch a lot of movies and series and okay. make dinners and go to play, go eat dinner with Tamo or mm. lunches and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what series, TV series, movies you watch? Oh. What's, it's probably a shorter list if I say the ones I haven't watched now because <laughs> there's so much free time after practice and everything is yeah. done. So, um, But I would say right now I'm watching Spartacus. It's a pretty, it's a Roman back in the days kind of fighting with swords kind of series. Uh, um, he t suggested it to me, so now I'm watching that. But uh, my favorite series would be probably Suits. Or, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Or Breaking yeah. Bad and stuff like that. Those yeah, are pretty yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. Charlie's it was close. <laughs> I've been you're so, getting there. Yeah, it's like your goal is on <laughs> steroids or something. Yeah. Okay, uh, what skill you like to learn? Like singing or cooking or scoring goals. Yeah, scoring <laughs> goals. Yeah. You don't need to learn. I need to learn how to score goals. <laughs> Playing an instrument like really well would be cool, I think. Mm -hmm. Like if I could just like be at a campfire and pull out a guitar and just like start playing whatever yeah. I wanted, I think that's kind of neat. Yeah. Either, either that or, or knowing a third language okay. would be cool. Yeah. I think either one. Yeah. I think if I knew like Spanish or German or something, like a whole other language, I'd be mean, like yeah. that. 
Or take Russian. Yeah, yeah, it's so me that I didn't can talk. Yeah. How about you? Uh, I was thinking the language too, but but I don't know. I'm not very good at learning new new languages, so your English maybe. is good though. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. But yeah, maybe Germany. Mm -hmm. That would be nice. Yeah. And maybe useful for working and stuff like that. Mm. Yeah. Did you already took this? No. <laughs> okay, let my goal. I let my goalie be here, and you can try to score. I'm trying to practice. <laughs> Give this guy another chance. Give him one. Why can't I? Charlie, do it. I can't shoot that side of the net. What like, do I have to do here? This kind of same question. If you could have one superpower, Ooh. what it would be? Like flying, being invisible. <laughs> so, um, I think teleporting would be my superpower. And why? Like, why? Why not? Like, yeah. if I wanted to be like, ha, huh, Bahamas, and just yeah. be gone. Yeah. <laughs> like, if that, it's cold, you know, good. like, yeah. I don't even need to do the flying part, I'm just already there. Yeah. Like, yeah. you know, it's that easy. Yeah. Like, flying, you have to, like, fly over yeah. the sea, and then, like, it's long. You know, I just want to snap my fingers, and I'm there. Yeah. Oh, here we go. I can't. Give me a break here. Yeah, Tinti, leave it to this. Number two is not on fire right now. Maybe if I shoot backhand. That's the trick. Right. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's the trick. I've been shooting forehand the whole time. Is there one more? Yeah, one more left. Yeah. Nice. I'm happy. I, oh. That's the last one. Yeah. We're gonna have to. Here we go. All right, Timo. Last one, buds. What kind of jokes you like? Tell one. Jokes. Short one. It's over. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <Yeah. laughs> That's good, actually. <laughs> Turha sitä on ikkunasta kyttäillä. Tilaa taksi kätevästi Booker-taksisovelluksella ja tiedät milloin taksi on pihassa.